Well, greetings from the South this morning. I have some fun news to share with you. Uh, any of you uh, new followers may not know this, but I did a little clip, I don't know, a little while back about my experience as a Playboy Bunny in Phoenix. Well, yesterday I received a strange email from New York. Well, you know, usually those are, you know, they go straight to the trash. But I opened it and it was from Newsweek. Little Monica from Newsweek asked me if I would do an interview on an article that she saw on TikTok about being a Playboy Bunny. Well, I thought, well, I'll just be careful what I say. You know, sometimes they twist those things around and make them say things you don't mean to say. But uh, she said it would first come back to me and and I would approve it before it went to uh, end of their Newsweek. It'll be in their online Newsweek. And then possibly the paper uh, back part of Newsweek will pick it up. So that's remains to be seen. Anyway, she called me this morning and we had a, almost a 40 minute interview. It was kind of neat, but um, I'll post another photograph at the end of this little clip of the uh, me in a Playboy Bunny outfit. I guess it was called a costume. But anyway, it was kind of neat. She asked me about all the highlights of working there and what I had, what was required to work there. And I told her all that. And um, you had a proper way to serve. And then uh, you had to do fashion shows once a week. Uh, the big boutiques in town would bring us their clothes. And well, I had some favorite uh, clients. Of course, they're big shotting. You know, they have a key to the Playboy Club. And they would always buy me whatever I modeled. So I liked doing that. And I got a lot of clothes that way. But um, it was fun. She was, uh, well, it was exciting. And I hope that they print something favorable. So I'll let you know if it comes out because we'll all have to look. But how fun. That gives this widow woman something to look forward to, some fun thing in my life. But, oh, and one other thing. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm getting the sweetest letters from different parts of the United States. They're still coming in. It makes it, it's so funny. I walk into the post office and, uh, I don't even have to go to my box anymore with my key. He has to say, oh, you got a letter or you got three letters or whatever. He he gets, jumps up and gets it for me. <laughs> it's, it's fun. <clears throat> anyway, I guess that's my little two bits for today. I'm going to be famous in Newsweek <laughs> over being a bunny when I was 21. Anyway, uh, I'll put a couple photographs in here. At the end, you have to stay to the end. Thanks for stopping in. I love y'all. Thanks for the letters, too.